Hey everyone, what is going on? So today, what are we doing with today? We're taking a look at something which is a, a bit of an oddity, really, in my collection. Um, something I recently refound. It is um, a thing I made at school when I was 12, I think. It was a, No, yeah, it would have been 12. And, yeah, it's a Doctor Who board game I did for DT. I thought, hey, why? Well, might as well try and... Um, yeah, I'll show you what I was going for, I think, uh, if I can kind of remember. So, uh, it's called Territories. Possibly, I think I might have spelt that wrong, knowing me. It says six plus, so it's four players, and it may contain small parts. I think it only contains a mat. But there you go, we have a... Sam, I think that's a bubble bath side man. And a Genesis Dalek, which might... Is that a figure? Uh, that's possibly the figure. Yeah, not, and then it's slightly on the side because, you know, I was good at things like that. Anyway, uh, if you take the lid off, uh, we went, oh, we've got secrets, they must not be seen. We must look at the back. So we have, lay on detectors as you walk through Dalek and Cybermen territories. I can't spell territories there, I can't spell it on the front. I need to make my mind up, really. Contains four counters, one board game, one board, and a spinner. That's the board without anything on it. Any, uh, as it was pointed out to me later on, it looks like a thumbs up. There's the arm, there's the thumb, there's the wrist. Then we have some rapey snowmen. Good look at them. Here's the board. There is a note on back, and then here we have all the different territories split up in uh, four. So we have Dalek. If you roll a five, you go back to the start. That, that was the idea me and my friend had, I think. Was um, each area, if you rolled a certain number, you had to go back uh, back to the beginning of that territory. It's like you got spotted, kind of thing. And then I think if you rolled it, um, whatever number you got, it wasn't like you'd move that many forward. So Santorini was roll a three, roll a six, land on 13, go back to one, and roll a one, go back to 14. There. This is the uh, great intelligence, and there's the Cyberman. Uh, not the best thing in the world, but hey, it was alright. I, I think I got a good mark actually for this. I think I got a pretty good. Oh, you can tell my cutting skills then were amazing. That's a bit of paper. But yeah, uh, it's alright. I mean, it does fold up and stay in one piece. Um, if anyone says that this is really good, then. Uh, uh, thank you, and also, do you uh, understand what good means? But I think for a 12-year-old thing, it looked all right. Uh, the person who did it as well with had never really seen Doctor Who, um, so that they they just like the idea of that being, you know, a rapist snowman. And you know, it doesn't. Uh, it's just um, I really I think if that was true, the snowman, Frosty the snowman, and multiple other things would have a very different ending and starting. To be honest. They wouldn't be family, family classics then, would they? No. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit the like button as it helps so, so, so much. And also subscribe for daily Doctor Who videos. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. God, that was awful. Bye.